the hallowed grounds brought to you by Siegfried and Jensen. Welcome in to this week's episode of the hallowed grounds Ogden Dolphin Country Club hole number three second hardest hole in the golf course Alex Carey everybody KSL News Radio KSL Sports Sorry, my voice just did something that it shouldn't have. And his 11-year-old uh, son, Cooper, big Coops, he's here. Hey, you guys are going to play a uh, two-man scramble. So you can essentially choose the best shot. Uh, I'm going to play my own ball. Coop is 11, so he gets to play from the junior tees. But let me tell you, Coopsy, when you turn 12 this year or next, you've you got to come back up to the red. So you've come at a good time. Bushnell wingman up for grabs. If you beat me, you have to beat me fair and square. Okay, and then we go to a playoff hole, the rest is history. But, either way, I won't let you leave empty handed. Couple of vouchers, Tiber oh, Valley. That's so nice. Wasatch Golf Course, Soldier Hollow, and of course, Homestead. Homestead. Uh, that's what we call a snap left hook. That's pretty good. My ball's like 50 yards up from these junior tees. Now these tees are 11 and under, Coopsie's 11. I think we outdrove Tom, that's all that matters. You and Scott Mitchell, you've been doing your radio show for? Right. How long? Uh, it'll be, it's two years this month. So, wow. Um, yeah, Unrivaled have uh, been going for two years. We revived the Nightside Project just for the, the Rona. Is that, that what we're calling what it, it now? Right? <laughs> yeah, the Rona? For, it's like when you, it's one of those kids you, you're like, he's creative, he's a creative kid. He doesn't get good grades, but he's creative and kind of fun. That's the night side project. <laughs> okay, we'll take Coopers. <laughs> <laughs> You've got hallowed ground. If, if that's the name of Tom's show, this would be the name of my golf show right here. Ground under repair. That's basically my entire life. A lot of sports coming back sooner rather than later. Your radio show. I imagine you haven't had a ton to talk about. It's been a, it's been a tad dire. Yeah. But hopefully soon you'll have a ton. Uh, excitement levels must be high. Well, the, the joke we have is, is that people are like, you guys don't have anything to talk about. I'm going, this is, we have a talk. Well, first of all, it's a talk show. So we're not trying to report on anything on our show. All we do is pontificate anyway. So it's actually been really good for us to be able to just jam. Summers are slow anyway. Hey, Cooper, are you a Utah BYU fan? BYU. Okay. Um, the, so, Coops, I don't know if you know, the, the parking lot, the car park's that way. <laughs> the car park. Yeah. The car park. Hey, let's go hit way. Cooper's second ball because we haven't used one of yours yet, all right, Kerry? <laughs> uh, I like that shot. It's a nice shot, Coop. Yeah. Generally, it's over because I made bogey. You, you're, This is a bogey right. putt. You have to beat me. We can't draw. Yeah, but, but because a, you're 11 year old, kids here, are present. Like you could be charged with a misdemeanor with a child Just in, in my presence. Just make the putt, okay? Make the putt. Mm. It's a nice roll. Hey, uh, unfortunately it didn't work out. Can you stay six feet away from me, please? Thanks for coming out. Yeah, thanks for having us. No worries. And Coops, I really like your swing. First child on the show this season. Yeah. Uh, and we won't let you leave empty handed. $100 gift card to you into golf. Hey. Coming your way, not dad's way. No. Your way, buy what be, you want. It, it would be absolutely wasted on me anyway. Yeah, you took one shot and you could have either, t you could have taken his, if you, you, you just decided to take yours because you, you wanted one of your shots to be taken. <laughs> That's how we play. This is basically how we golf every time. I start out nice and then uh, he ends up beating me in the end, so. Ogden Golf and Country Club, Nate Wade Subaru, we appreciate all you guys. Cooper, Alex Carey, everybody. In a good golf swing, you try to sink the arms and the body up, okay? So it would look something like this, okay? When Randy came to me 14 years ago, um, 14 years? 14 years ago, Sarge. Yes, hmm. it was. My golf game hasn't gotten a lot better, no. so we need to use that speed stick but, a lot Plus more. that's 12 years longer than I thought you'd last. But um, <laughs> Randy is intense, okay? If you've ever watched him on the sidelines, he's, he's fairly, how many tees this year? I can't remember, I don't think there was, I think it was less than five. Excellent, so you're getting soft. So Randy would, and a lot of people will do this, they will, they will have a lot of body movement and this doesn't, doesn't move. So as they swing, they go like this and this is very slow. We wanna get this moving fast. So we got Randy um, swinging this way, moving this. With a light one, 
it's much easier to, to feel that whip at the bottom. So you can turn your club over and do it, right? Get the same feeling. If, and you want your speed from there to right here. So you're going here, swinging that way. Bushnell has uh, come out with a very innovative product called the Wingman. Uh, this is a Bluetooth speaker. Uh, great sound quality, but we've done a couple things to make this not just a Bluetooth speaker. One, this is a GPS. 107. See, one thing I like about this unit is it gives you general front, back, middle, but on a big green like this, I really like using it in conjunction with a laser. A laser can tell you within nine inches of something. And my uh, GPS here is gonna tell me 92 to the front, 120 to the middle. This is a long green. So this just dialed it into 107. Now I can screw up from there, but at least I know the facts. Golf for days in Heber Valley at one of five beautiful mountain courses. Wasatch Golf Course, Soldier Hollow Golf Course, and the Homestead Golf Club are all within seven miles of each other. Enjoy the feeling of getting away without the long drive.